There's an appeal at the Scottish Church in Pont Street for old clothes. They're collecting for Russian refugees. I know you won't have brought anything with you you want to throw away, but you might spread the word. Of course. Actually, I've been on at Mr Bates to take advantage of being in London and get a few things. The trouble is, he does hate shopping. That must be because he's a man. Success! I have finally persuaded Mr Bates to buy a new overcoat, so you can have this for the refugees. That's just what they need. Are you sure? Take it. He'll only go on wearing it as long as it's in the house. Well, they'll be very grateful. I'd better get back. I know. There's always plenty of fuss before a presentation. There is, but I think it's exciting. Seems odd to me that a curtsy and a nod from the throne can turn you from a girl into a woman, but that's the way they do it, so who are we to argue? <laughs> oh. May I help, Mrs Hughes? I was just looking for Anna, but it uh, doesn't matter. So Bates was in London that day. You say it as if you already knew? Does Anna suspect anything? Absolutely not. She knows nothing. So will you tell her now, milady? I gather you won't. No. No, I'm handing this to you. Meaning leave it alone? We can't know what happened on that street. Maybe he was in London for an innocent reason and nowhere near Piccadilly. But this I will say. If he was there to avenge his wife's honour, I won't condemn him for it. I'm sorry, but I won't. <laughs> <laughs>